there's not a whole lot of point to this particular thing. I guess it's just to weed out the real idiots. But basically, we've got a password field here that's asking us to type in the password. But what we're going to do is we're going to actually view the source for the page to see what, what things look like. So I'm just going to right click and I always like to, uh, I'm using Mozilla and uh, the web developer pack. So if you go into the uh, thing, you can view the, the actual source code. If it doesn't lock up on you, go in here and view the source code and tell it to view generated source. The it, It's a good idea to, to practice doing it this way because you can uh, make sure that in case they've got JavaScript or things getting loaded in the background that this this will actually go out and get all of the source code related to what the page looks like even if they're using Ajax on the page. So once we get the page loaded we're just going to do a quick search here for the looking at the actual uh, web page they have uh, a heading above the the field that says password so we're just going to search for password and as you can see the person that did this actually has the password encoded inside of the file so we'll just exit out of the source code type in the source code or the password that we got out of there and it comes up and tells you that you're done